exciting for starts. Today is the day, the day we tie the knot, but to be honest, I feel like we have already completed that. Michael, I cannot believe our wedding day is finally here. It took us a while, but I'm so glad I get to call you my husband today. The most, but the thing is, if you ask me, I wouldn't change a thing. These things we have done formed us to what we are. I promised you that we would be married, and in a moment, you'll walk towards your future and your forever. Who knew all of it was you sliding into my Facebook messages and asking me what my favorite cereal was my freshman year. Although it did take a while for me to realize that we belong together. I'm so glad that we waited and have been together ever since. God is in control of us now and the future is bright. I can't wait to become old, sassy, and wrinkly with you. I know not everyone is with us and trust me, I am dealing with this as well, but regardless of that, let's make more the best of us. The moment I first fell in love with you was on your graduation night when we went out with some friends to celebrate. You had said, I really want, really want to ask your mom first for her permission. I thought that was the sweetest thing ever and it made me fall head over heels for you. I hope that this is plenty for you and I cannot wait to say our ideas. This is the sort of new page in our lives. I can't wait to see you in a few. I love you and I'll be waiting for you. P.S. Will you marry me? Yes or yes. I'm so looking forward to our first kiss as husband and wife. I remember when you wrote me a letter years ago, we had talked about our wedding and how simple our kiss was going to be, and now it's finally going to happen. I'm so glad that we found each other. I honestly feel like we complete each other. Most importantly, I'm glad I chose you to be my husband and um, the father to our future children. There's no doubt in my mind that you're going to be an incredible father someday to our future kids. You already are a great dog dad to Bertha. I promise to love you every day for the rest of our lives, even when life gets hard. Um, but knowing as it's going to be more good times than bad times, I'm so grateful for you. You're the man of my dreams. Love your life, Ashley.
I, I really, I had a lot of words to say, but now I'm nervous. <laughs> Welcome to the family, and now I could say, you could say, I'm your mother-in-law. And I told her one time, when you get married, I'll give it to you. I don't think you remember. And I save it for this day. So you take a look at it, and it might fit you. You two make a wonderful couple. Michael, I know Asha loves you with all her heart, and you are her true friend and true love. You both were so very young when you first team met, seven years ago. I don't know. These two, they hold a very special place in my heart. Um, Michael's like the brother I never had. Ashley's like another sister. I got plenty of those. <laughs> yeah, no, they, they're amazing, and they have deserved this, and they deserve everything, and I really hope y'all hurry up and have babies. No one's ever perfect for you, but Ashley, you are perfect in every Aww. way, friend. And I think you're pretending so good. Don't you give up now. Don't you give up. Don't you give up on me. Don't you give up. Don't you give up now. Don't you give up. Don't you give up. On me.